Before moving to the pagination part, I would like to design these images some margin and some kind of things. So what I can do first, uh, here we are showing the images and I'm using this flex and I can remove the totally I can remove the flex and now I can see it's all around after one another in a column. Okay, so I, I'm going to give a style and the style is with this two curly braces it will be column count and a count will be let's say three how about this so yeah three is there but then i want these images to be having a full width so i go to the image where i have the image tag instead of 150 i can say 100 percent let's see still it's not having that kind of steps so one more uh, which i can have from the tailwind css which is uh, gap gap between the columns is zero and that's okay but still it should be 100 percent but it's not there so what about height if I set it to auto mm, okay I got the point <laughs> the point is I need to remove this one so I remove it and yeah it is looking nice and we have some margin at the top so margin 4 I can remove the margin 4 yes it is good one thing I can give is padding of 2 like here but I can give border so yeah it is nice so padding of one and margin of one also now see this looking good looking good if I can give a margin of uh, padding of zero and margin of one no padding is required okay so looking great and this image this is not any images okay so yeah okay so it is looking good and next what i can do i can actually give the count to five yeah okay so this is fine for me maybe six will be more good okay five one is good <laughs> So this is how we have little bit designing in the images and now we can actually go and try to implement the pagination.